Mass Effect 2 is a landmark game that fulfills all the promise of its predecessor while taking its own strides forward. Bioware's second act in this trilogy has lived up to all of the hype and then some, delivering intense action, dramatic storytelling, and one of the most personal games ever created. This epic sci-fi role-playing game continues the story of Commander Shepard, a distinguished soldier who knows firsthand of an impending galactic apocalypse and the suicidal steps that must be taken to avert it. It's also a story of love, friendship, and family faced with hopeless odds, of civilization at its tipping point, and of the darkest recesses of humanity brought to the forefront. It's a character-driven tale that continues to get better with each new introduction to this fantastic cast of heroes. And it's all told with that same cinematic style and interactivity that made Mass Effect one of the greatest role-playing games in recent history. We're trapped. How disquieting. The Normandy's got guns. Use them. The Normandy lacks the necessary firepower. To say that Mass Effect 2 is cinematic and interactive would only begin to explain the presentation. Yes, the innovative conversation wheels back, and so is the excellent direction and outstanding voice acting. They're still so, so far ahead of the pack. Mass Effect 2 also adds a twist. Provided you've played through the first Mass Effect and haven't erased your save data, the sequel will take all the decisions made there to personalize the story. Add in new choices made in this game, and you have one of the most personal video games ever. Kalisa been seen in Al Jalani, Westernland News. I interviewed you two years ago when you first became a Spectre. Now, the main plot won't drastically change, but the overall experience most certainly will. That's why this game will be so much more powerful if you have played the first one. And if you took issue with some of the technical problems Mass Effect suffered from, Bioware was listening. Elevator rides and slow loading textures are out. Generic side missions and pointless exploration are gone. The menus have been streamlined, as has the inventory and upgrade system. The result is a cleaner feel that allows the look and artistic style of Mass Effect to truly shine. It really is a beautiful game. The gameplay has also seen revisions and improvements. Small tweaks to the controls and combat mechanics deliver something that everyone, both hardcore RPG fans and those bred on action games, can get behind. The combat is intense and thrilling, thanks in no small part to the reworked character classes, which add new skills and offer just in themselves reason to replay the game. The Vanguard seriously kicks ass. It doesn't hurt that Bioware put a new emphasis on exploration while also removing all of the generic cut and paste quest design that so many games suffer from, Mass Effect 1 included. Every major side quest has its own story and unique area to explore. Little extra missions exist only for those willing to explore every bit of this vast galaxy, and new gameplay twists keep all of these quests from growing stale. Technical improvements are great, but it's the role playing aspects that really make Mass Effect 2 so memorable. The class and skill systems allow you to make Shepard truly your own. But it's through talking to the various galactic citizens and making tough decisions that allows you to shape the game to be yours and yours alone. Bioware truly is approaching that idyllic role-playing experience that's both cinematic and unique to the individual. Everybody that plays Mass Effect 2 will get something a bit different, and that's an incredible achievement. Even with all of the improvements, both technical and artistic, Mass Effect 2 is still not a perfectly polished game. Everything from getting stuck in the environment to sound cutting out to total game crashes do occur, though not often enough to ruin things. The first Mass Effect game was ahead of the curve in so many ways. This sequel continues to push those boundaries while cleaning up nearly all the technical issues and nailing the game mechanics. This is an experience that delivers in every way that matters. Pick any aspect of the game and you can be sure it'll be great. Combat, exploration, storytelling, voice acting, replay value, artistic style, they're all fantastic. It's also one of the most personal games you'll ever play, adapting remarkably to your past actions in Mass Effect 1, as well as the choices you make in this sequel. The only real drawback I should point out is that some of the cooler moments and revelations won't go over as well with you if you haven't played the first in the trilogy, but that is no reason to miss out on this wonderful game. Go buy it, this isn't one you can afford to miss. For all the latest on Mass Effect 2, stay tuned to IGN.com.